Welcome to the Strenuous Life Radio with J.R. Hendrick, a podcast for leadpreneurs, entrepreneurs, men and women learn the essentials and soft skills of the strenuous life. Hey guys, sit down here. I want to learn, teach you a few things about confidence and how the confidence that you need to have as a leadpreneur. How about we try something here? I'm going to lay this down here, and I'm going to go ahead and close up and out and out here I'm doing on a James Hendrick Empowerment computer. We're going to go to the uh, Gospel Library app. Don't worry. The uh, What we're going to be using is uh, some verses from the King James Bible. And get this computer to cooperate. We're going to talk about confidence as a leaderpreneur. I remember when I was in college, <laughs> I was top of the hill, willing to do what was necessary. The thing is, though, my ex wife, uh, Chris, was real fond of. Pointing outwards, I had no confidence. So, we're going to look up confidence. And we're going to look it up here in the uh, inner scriptures. Or first, particularly, I think uh, New Testament would be nice. All right, we may have to go to the concordance here. Wouldn't you know it's a having to go to concordance and instead of doing what you want to do, which is do a word search. But sometimes things don't work out the way they are, but that's why you need confidence. That's why you need confidence, and that's why I'm here. Okay, let's let's just go ahead and do a, a, a scripture search again for confidence. It's got to be in there. Give me a break. I'll give you. Few Bible verses on on uh, uh, confidence. Okay, here's something. Better it is to put your trust in the Lord than to put your confidence in men. I gotta say this: I I dearly love the Lord, and I love what He does for us. So you need confidence. I think I think people need the Lord Jesus Christ. That's all there is to it. And I'm going to um, come up with maybe three more Bible verses and we'll make it the best episode we can. You see, here's the thing about confidence. You get it by da- your daily habits is one thing. Jimmy here, I've had to get on to him about not not being on the, the, the daily habits. He's supposed to be on every day. Regular habits, it, 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 they count towards your confidence, whether you want to believe it or not. So let me get back in the scripture. In whom we have access, access and confidence by the faith of him. You put your faith in Jesus Christ. That's one thing that's going to help you have confidence. Your daily habits are important also. Taking care of yourself gives you confidence. 
If you don't, if you, if you don't do these things, that that's that's what keeps you from being the effective leader for you the church that God has called you to be. I want you to think about that. The, the importance of the how how important that is. I'm mindful of the of the theologian uh, dealer F. Oakdorf who talks about the ongoing restoration of God, of God and how we can have confidence to not deviate. To not deviate from our daily habits. From our, not deviate from our closeness to the Lord. The covenants that we make with Him. So I want you to think about that. Now we hope that you enjoy listening to Streamless Life Radio. If you like what you hear, please subscribe. Become a part of Streamless Life Family. Like my daddy always said, think strong, live strong. Live the strenuous life. God bless you.